Hello, and welcome to Read Up. Here we get to explore the wonderful world of reading. Today we are going to read about how hard life on the prairie in the 1800s was. In the book, The School Children's Blizzard by Marty Rhodes Figley, readers are swept away to Nebraska in the year 1888. It was in this year, on the day of January 12th, that a deadly blizzard struck a prairie town and 16 children were trapped inside a schoolhouse. The story follows the perilous journey of two sisters, Sarah and Annie, as they make their escape with their classmates to survive. Written by Marty Rhodes Figley and illustrated by Shelley O'Haas, The School Children's Blizzard is actually a story based on real life events that happened in Nebraska during that time period. The intricate pictures helps to bring the story to life as the dramatic tale of heroism unfolds. Here is a preview from the book. Get inside, yelled Sarah. She pulled Annie toward the schoolhouse. Miss Freeman rang the bell with all her might. Come, children, quickly. When the children were all safe inside, Miss Freeman slammed the door. She fastened it tight. The students huddled by the stove. The room was getting colder every minute. Sarah began to shiver. Everyone looked frightened, even Jake and Seth. Sarah had never seen them scared of anything. We have plenty of coal for the stove to keep us warm, said Miss Freeman. We'll be fine until the storm ends. Sarah rubbed her icy hands together. She hoped her teacher was right. The wind howled like a pack of wolves. The windows started to rattle. Crash! The door burst open. Swirling snow blew into the school. Miss Freeman tried to push the door shut. The wind had broken its leather hinges. Find out what happens next by reading The School Children's Blizzard, which can be found at your local library. Thanks for watching and continue to read up.